Chunky Monkeys, welcome back to my channel. And I want to wish you all a Merry Christmas because I forgot what I was gonna say. Hey, my Chunky Monkeys, welcome back to my channel. I want to thank everybody for the support and their feedback from the last video. So last week we covered how to do a proper body fat and weigh in with your trainer. And this week we'll be sitting down with Big Daddy Fitness to talk about how to find the proper trainer what questions you should be asking or what you should be looking for. We're back here with Nico, day two of my training with him. Yeah. So like I told you in the first video, I was gonna help you guys find the perfect trainer. So Nico, tell us what does it take to find the right, the right trainer, what questions to ask and everything. What questions should you ask, what he should be doing, what he should be looking Top at. Top three things, look at his background history, whether it's transformations, uh, certified, uh, people talking about, you know, like maybe uh, people said I had bad news about the person if he's good. Just best get, get to know him before you go see him. You know what I mean? Just like buying a car. Before buying yeah. a car, you do research online, right? Or like what's the negatives, what's the positive on it? That's one thing. Second thing is you have to have a, a bond. So when you go for consultations, uh, obviously on the back, you don't have to buy any programs or anything, right? You have to find the guy first. You go say, okay, I want to meet, I want to meet your consultation. And if you feel you guys are on the same page, you guys are getting, are close. It's not cold. That's another good sign. Because don't forget, we're we're gonna be with her for a while right now. So if you have a vibe, even if the coach is good, but he doesn't have a good sense of humor or character, or doesn't push you, not motivating you, right? Then it's not for you, right? You gotta go what's what's best for you. It's like a date. It's, it becomes that's called personal training. It's very personal, right? We're very intimate. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And the other thing, obviously, somebody that, uh, besides practicing what you preach, uh, passionate, that's motivating and pushing you. So you know that that person is basically keeping you accountable by doing the body fat test, by texting you. When you when he texts you or calls you, he responds. Not two days after, like some coaches, oh, and they find excuses. No, they have to be there for the clients at all times. So this is why, obviously, someone's paying for services. You want your, you not only service, but you want 100% on everything, motivation and whatnot. So, so yeah. I happened to meet Nico through uh, through a mutual contact. I didn't do my research. I went with the results I saw you did with, with another client of yours, uh, Costa. Costa, yes. You yes. did some amazing work with him. At the age of he is 45 yeah, years old. Yeah, it looks he, amazing. He has... One of the greatest physiques I've seen in a long yeah, time. Yeah. And he's doing competitions. That's right. Well. He, he actually got second place at his last show. He was going against a 20 something year old, and he's 44 at that time. So, all this show, it's never too late. But obviously, the right the guidance, the dedication, determination, consistency is key. Everything is possible. Absolutely. So, tell me, Nico, how long have you been doing this? Been what, doing this? what got you involved? 20 in years I've been doing fitness. And for me, it was Arnold Schwarzenegger. The reason why, it sounds cliche, but it's because he's done it all. From basically, besides competitions, from acting, uh, motivation, saying anything is possible. He came from a little town, right? And basically, he came to the biggest name in bodybuilding, but in general. So that's one of my motivation. But the other one is to for myself, esteem, confidence too. I was very skinny when I was younger, obviously. That, that's why we have the, the mutual connection. Like exactly. Like you guys in the first video. So are. for me, yeah, people say it doesn't matter about the shape, but you know what, it does matter because you have to feel good in your skin. For myself, yeah, I, I'm a great person, great, you know, I socialize with people, but I still want to be happy. That's why what I do is what I do is this, and I want to help people achieve that because I feel for them. I'm not just been doing it because I, I love it. I just love it. I love fitness, yeah, but I've been through that. And that's what I want to help out everybody that can do. Whether it's weight loss or let's say for in his situation, dropping body fat, when he started with skinny, same thing. We all have a goal and that's what I love doing. You know what I mean? So one last thing we're going to ask Nico today because uh, he has other clients is give our guys, motivate them. What would you get them to get them out of bed? So basically, I have one simple thing, guys. If you're not happy the way you look, is take a picture of yourselves. Stick, the, stick that picture on top of the mirror. The morning you wake up, wherever you wash your face, wherever mirror you use the most. And tell yourself, if you're happy, cool. If you're not, keep on looking at that picture and say, do you want to become like that or better? Keep on motivating yourself. So every time you see your question, why am I doing this? Just look at that picture and tell yourself, you know what? I'm going to beat that guy. Become the best version of yourself. Don't compare yourself to anybody. But become the best version of yourself and that will make you happy. When you're happy, healthy, and energy, everything around you is amazing. You, you, you attract how you feel. Exactly. When you leave positive, that gym, of it, course. You're, you're, and even in business, when you feel good, look good, the way you're speaking, it's so positive that people just leech on you. And that's how it is. So, so, so step one, let's get motivated. Exactly. Let's hit the gym. Find that right trainer. Exactly. And I get the program. Set the goal. Set a goal. That's very important. And most one. important, I always say, is consistency is key. You keep at it, guys. You don't, some days you have good and bad days, it's fine. Flip the page, you keep on going. Don't, don't derail completely, you know what I mean? It's a step at a time. Nothing's built over one day. But if you really want something bad enough, you'll make it happen, no matter what.
Just gotta get a deep stretch, squeeze. That's it. Try and keep your elbows straight, don't pick it up higher. Right there. Yeah, no swinging, bring it down, let's go. Come on. Let's go, six more, come on. One, squeeze it out. Two, let's go. Three, come on, push it, come on. Four, let's go. Five, one more. Nice, good job. Zertenmel, we do the, the tricep. <laughs> Let's go. In my village in Greece, we use the goat. <laughs> Here in Canada, we ski. <laughs> Let's go. Kick it back, come on. Control. Keep pushing. Try and keep your arms close in. Let's go. Make it hurt. Come on. Make it hurt. Let's go. Push. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Let's go. If it gets heavy, you drop it out to complete your set. The rep, exactly. Let's go, give me six more. One, come on. Two, three, push it, push it. Yeah. Four, let's go. Five, and six, fantastic. Ah! Oh, what the fuck are you trying do? to do my way, baby? Are you nuts? Did you see my tries, baby? You wanna get those big daddy tries, you gotta push it, baby. Let's go, let's go. I'm just doing this for the beach. There ain't no beach here, baby. I'm the beach. <laughs> I'll make you my bitch when we're done. <laughs> let's go. Push it up. Come on, let's go. Lower weight? Yeah, lower weight. Yeah, so whenever it gets hard, guys, obviously you want to push good, but the form has to be there. So, Chris right now just drop the weight up a bit. Make sure he executes proper form and, and reps in. So, give me six proper reps. Migo doesn't understand that I have to drive home after. <laughs> That's the fun part. Let's go. Nice. Good, good, keep going, let's go. Push it, push it. Come on, come on. On the next video, I'll be teaching you guys how to drive with your knees. Feels good? It does. Next week we can get the results, body fat test, see what your progress is. It's been two weeks since then. Week three is the, uh, the second body fat test. Yes. So we gotta give all we got, right? Remember I told you positive thinking and the energy, you just, you just push through. Exactly. Don't even think about it. And the results will come. Let's go. Consistency is key. Let's go, keep plugging, keep plugging. Let's go. Let's go, you got two more in you. You got two more, find it. One more, find it. Let's go. There you go. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. I have also asked Nico to give us a five day program for beginners. It'll be coming very shortly within the next couple weeks. And don't forget, baby weights is the name. Failure is not the game. What the? What are you guys still doing here? Get out of here. Go to the gym.